welcome back to the Outer Worlds. Uh, last episode we were uh, heading back to the ship here because we got the engine part that we need or a part to get this heap off the ground I guess and without any wow you followed me okay cool you want to take a trip and yes that was that's Edgewater back there and unfortunately we are not in Saskatchewan so that's not Edgewater Saskatchewan so um, if you play Farming Simulator 22 you'd understand that one so oh the unreliable <laughs> okay cool um, let's get aboard this puppy I think the door's on the other side of course is this, is this your, your ship? ship? oh, oh my, my stars, stars. She's she's just so handsome. handsome does she, does she have, have a name yet? yet? what's, what's, what's drive? her drive model? oh, oh. gosh, gosh. <laughs> let me babbling when I was, when I was in Edgewater I dreamed of flying on a real ship working on a real, real engine, engine. Those deserters left Edgewater behind, nothing keeping you from doing the same. You never been on a ship before? Why are you telling me this? Uh, well, if it's good for me to start having a crew, you know what? I have, I have imagined, imagined it, it, but until, until you, you came, came along, along, I never thought I had a choice. choice. I want to ask, ask you something, and you, you can say, say no. no. But, but, can I, can I come with you? I can, I can tend to your engine. engine. I know I my G-valves, my, valves, my catalyzers, catalyzers, and I can keep your, your ship singing. singing. And, if and if you ever need a pair of eyes watching your back, I can get that too. What do you think? Well, she does have a point on that second one. I mean, she's been doing pretty good in combat. I'll be glad to have you along. Pick a cabin at yours. I guess Reed won't mind. What with being dead and all. You just met me. Why would you want to go into space with a stranger? Uh, well, I can't leave her behind. Because, like I said, it, you know, it's good to have a crew with you to battle with. And if she can, by chance, to keep the ship in the air, then, you know, hey. Yes, yes. I mean, I mean thanks. thanks. You won't, you won't regret this, Mister. Captain. I, I can, can call you Captain, Captain now. now. I got a captain. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> Oi. <laughs> okay, now we need to. Captain, I have detected that the town of Edgewater is now without power. I appreciate you doing your part to hasten their demise. Not a problem. Now, where do I go to, uh... What can I do for you, Captain? I have a power regulator. Do you know how to install a power regulator? Um... Not in the physical sense. Step one, pick up your power regulator. Step two, approach the terminal located in our engine room. Step three, insert power regulator. Step four, celebrate. Our engine room is located behind you, across the cargo bay, up the ladders. Um. Uh, 
Okay, now I know how to work a ladder. Ticket to Anywhere Trophy. Yeah. Okay, do I have to go back down the ladder? No need for me to run on the ship. I've installed the power regulator. All Can we get systems are operating within acceptable parameters. I am prepared to bring the unreliable into low altitude orbit. This should prove an adequate test of our flight capabilities. Then do it. Nothing I need to take care of. Oh yeah, engine sparking, good as new. There we go. That's low altitude orbit. Sorry, ice cream. Good, I've been waiting to hear from him, or this better be quick. Ah, there you are. Hey, the I see you're putting the unreliable to good use. How are you feeling, by the way? I lost track of the cave back there. Experiencing any unnatural slippage? Perfectly normal side effect of thawing. I feel you. You get to the point. I've been feeling a little lightheaded. Also, I can slow down time. Never been better. Get to the what point. What you saw in Emerald Vale is happening all across the colony. Food shortages, lack of supplies, and basic necessities. We are dying. The chairman, the minister, and all the lackeys on the board are to blame. The hope has some of the brightest minds ever sent us. If we can revive the whole colonists, they can help us undo the board's mistakes. They can, they can help, help us set things, things right. right. You, you need, need to get to Stella, Stella Bay on my monarch. I have come contacts there. They'll, they'll help me. They'll help us. Find chemicals, chemicals to revive your, your fellow colonists. colonists. Gladys, Gladys Kelly, 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 lovely woman, woman runs, runs some cozy, cozy little, little black, black marking, marking outfit, outfit on the ground breaker. She, she can get you a nap to land on Stella Bay. Bay. Fine, I will have to... I, I'll go have a word with Gladys. Why do I need a nav key to land on a planet? Slow down, you're asking me to get involved with the black market. Or could I put a couple light years between me and Halcyon? Halcyon? I don't know how to pronounce it. Can't I land somewhere outside Stellar Bay? I'll put it to good use, thanks. You want me... You want to explain what a Thane Shroud is? Yeah. Excellent. I'll, I'll contact, contact you once you found, found a way to get to Stella, Stella Bay. Bay. If you, if have, you have any questions, questions come, come see me in my lab. lab. And, and remember, remember, don't, don't trust, trust the board. The board. They'll, They'll try to win you over with promises of wealth, wealth and power. power. But, it's but it's a lie. lie. The board's, the board's only, only interested in filling their own pockets. If we don't stop them, they're going to run this colony to the ground. Transition ended. If you are ready to depart, please select a destination on your navigation terminal. 
Oh, navigation terminal. to go to oh do I have to go to the groundbreaker first I want it ah, okay nice we were right Okay. Okay, so we get to exit the ship, go to the groundbreaker. If you want to tag along, come along. If not, you can just hang out here, pick a room. If you haven't already done so. Wow, where the hell did this door come from? It's party selection. Well, yeah, I mean. Hey, Cap, hey, Cap. Can, we can we talk? Oh, there you are. Hey, hey Captain. Captain? I heard, I heard the ground breakers got, got a real good, good engineer. A lady, a lady named Mike Tennyson? Tennyson? I was I thinking, thinking that maybe, maybe I'd bought a meter. meter. If, you, if got you got time, time swing, swing by, by, I mean. I don't, I don't got, got much experience fixing actual, actual spaceships. spaceships. I bet you, I bet you can't, you can't abort abort some beans. You could teach me all manner of stuff. stuff. I thought you said you can keep this boat in good repair. Are you asking to leave my crew and join hers? I don't think she'd be much help, but if you happen to be along, feel free to speak up. I don't think she'd be much help, but if you happen to be along, feel free to speak up. Head back to the ship. I'm going without you. We'll talk later. But right now. I go up here. Um, actually, hold on, do I? Uh, apparently. Okay, blast. Okay, so that's... Okay, um... I got sealed doors.
Okay, ow. Okay, where the fridge? Approved, board sponsored, board mandated by now. What? Oh, come on. Identification, please. Present Hawthorne's ID. Here you go. My name is Barkus. It's my first time here. Let's say hypothetically. Let's say hypothetically speaking, I don't have an ID. What happens then? Ooh, I'm interested in finding out. Got an ID. Oh, let me guess. You uh, left it in your other pants. I hear that one a lot. Sorry. <laughs> Captain Hawthorne, you said. Let me apologize in advance. I'm about to ruin your day. According to your ship's record, you've been flagged by the board. Your ship will be impounded until such a time as they see fit to lift it. But we've hardly been out of Edgewater long enough to get in trouble. Now, hold on. This isn't the end of the world. Probably. You'll want to take it up with Udom Bedford, our board representative here on Groundbreaker. His office is located along the starboard wall of the promenade. Shines like a Byzantium commode. Can't miss it. Just the opposite. The board knows we don't take kindly to their interfering in our operations here. They must have a real big bee in their bonnets, then. Everyone knows you don't trifle with groundbreaker if you want to get your goods on time. If I have to take a guess as to why, you probably riled up the wrong petty board bureaucrat. A man named Udom Bedford. You take the starch out of him, well, you won't hear any complaints from me. Oh, and if you're headed that way, would you mind doing me a favor? Wanda Dorset over in sick bay. Tell her the shipment's not in yet. It's not coming in anytime soon, and if she'd be so obliged to get off my ass about it. Not a problem. Much appreciated. Is there anything else I can help you with? Um, yeah, you can let me through these doors. her and the rest can go. On your left when you enter the promenade. Make sure you bring an empty belly. Um. Hmm. Be seeing you. Okay, now can I go through the doors? Whoa, jeez. Okay. Okay. Go back to Byzantium, you gold plated bastards. Yeah, no one wants you on Groundbreaker. These stairs are board property. The first now for all the pain you I'm just gonna hang in the back. Oh, that's Unum Befford. I wanted it. Ah, uh, yes. 
Wheeler messaged me you were coming. <coughs> must be the captain of the Unreliable, a vessel that used to be helmed by one Hawthorne. And you are not he. How long did it take you to figure that one? What happened to my favorite scruffy freelancer? Sorry, pecan ice cream. Um, has something happened to my favorite scruffy freelancer? Yeah. Uh, he's dead. Forget him. Why'd you impound my ship? I'm gonna ring your scrawny neck, you Yeah. Uh, give me back my ship. Um, Alex isn't important. I'm here to turn in Phoebeus Wells, or Phineas Wells. I'm not dealing with this right now. Um, hmm. I forgot what I was going to have to do to him. What? the lock on your ship in a show of my gratitude. An apprehension of this caliber will be tremendous for my career. I'll send you straight away to my superiors in Byzantium, only... Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Spit it out. The thing is, I needed money. A lot of money. Quickly, for reasons. So far, so entirely expected what happened. I might have pawned my official board seal to Gladys, the black market fence here on the groundbreaker. I can't authorize the paperwork we'll need to turn Phineas in without it. To give away something so important to you, there must have been some curious reasons. I'll thank you not to question my motives, young miss. It was a mistake, and I'd like to put it behind me. It's, it's only temporary, temporary of, course. of course. I'd never leave something so important in the hands of someone of such dubious moral character. I was going to buy it back once I raised the capital. So you'll need to get my seal back from her if you want to hand Phineas over to the board. You have to be kidding me. How stupid can you be? What possessed you to pawn your official seal? So before I can do the board a favor and turn over Wells, I need you to do a favor first. Forget it, then I won't turn for any... <laughs> uh, let me see. So before I can do the board a favor and turn over Wells, I need... I need to do you a favor first. Hmm. That's the long and short of it, yes. Fine, I'll go talk to Gladys. Maybe I can work something out. Thank you. Oh, thank you I so much. I need to. I'm certain Gladys can be made. Well, can probably be made to see reason. <laughs> I'll be waiting eagerly for your return. Now, is there any way in which I might assist you? I wanted to ask you something else. I don't know what. Mr. Wells, the fellow who woke you? How bad could he be? Mm hmm. I didn't ask him. I know she's in there. Are you Gladys? Bless my heart. A stranger come knocking on a poor old woman's door. You here for a particular reason? 
Or did the neighbors tell you how good my sugar cookies are? Made without a single natural ingredient, or an oven. Just like store-bought. Uh, Phineas sent me, he said you can sell me a nav key to Stiller Bay. Those have been the height of illegality since Stellar Bay turned their noses up at the board. You and I could be thrown to the void just, just, just for discussing dis such a transaction. Lucky for, for us, us groundbreakers are free free port. We're outside, outside of the board's, the board's control. control. For, the for the time, time being, at least. Now, now I, I only, only have, have the one nav key. key. And they're, and they're hard to come by these days. days. It, won't it won't be cheap. Be cheap. If, you if you find yourself lacking in the bits, bits I might, I might have, have an opportunity you'd be interested in. Tell me about this opportunity. Yeah, um, I am lacking bits because apparently I ain't got the 10,000 bits. <laughs> yeah, no one's ever found my bits lacking. Uh, Y'all can take that as any any uh, direction you want. Well, well I, find I find I'm in need of a ship captain with a little more, more of flexibility. Might, Might be this could help out the groundbreaker, as well as, well as, as earn some bits. bits. But if, but if you've got qualms... Do you, do you know Edna, Edna over, over in engineering? engineering? No. Sweet, Sweet as a pea, that, that one. On occasion, she'll pass along, she'll pass along transmissions, transmissions I might find interesting. Okay. She sent me a recording of a distress signal she'd scraped from the Groundbreaker's comm array. Curious thing is, it came from an outpost called Roseway. And Auntie Cleo abandoned that place years ago. Okay. You've got an ear for intrigue and a nose for bits. I like that. Here's a copy of the SOS recording, complete with the coordinates. If you should find a secret worth selling, might be I could find a buyer. Corporate bigwigs will pay top bit for inside information on their competitors. The more we got the corpse fighting each other, the less time they got to meddle in our affairs. Don't, Don't forget, forget to come, come find, find old Gladys, Gladys when you're done. done. I, found I found a handsome ceramic mandapillar at a salvage auction last week. Your merchant skill is equal to the value of your best dialogue skill and is used to negotiate prices when buying and selling from vendors. Um, I don't even know how much, how many bits I got, to be honest with you. Because that's 180 and it's DPS, it's white. This is 134. Oh, okay. Um. Sure, grip. Range weapon magazines increases the run and ammunition which carries. Ranged weapon mod. Magazine increases the amount of ammunition the weapon magazine carries. Oh, apparently I have 259 bits. This is 38.
Well, I do need more. Um. Bye. Okay, 259. Oh. I can't buy it. It's 591 bits. Um. Let me see. Sell. Sell. I'll keep a hold of at least one. Okay, I apparently got two of those. One here and that one there. So let me... Okay, Gladys is in there. Uh, um. Ooh, 
Ooh, I need light ammo. Energy cell. Do I already have one of these? Because I am not really sure. Huh. Ooh, that's like s too much. Uh, so we'll... Wait a minute, did I not just have... Like 230 something? Really, is it? more packing what anyway okay there's Gladys let's okay we need to go out the door wrong door Okay, why, what, where am I going? Um. Oh, we didn't even, uh. Hey, you got a second? Hey. We don't know each other yet, but I'm Felix Millstone. I was in the middle of a little discussion with the local authorities when you passed me by. I noticed your ship in port. Got to thinking you might be looking for some crew, so I wandered by. Just to take a closer look. Gotta hand it to you, boss. That's a fine-looking ship. Only thing it's missing is me. You're pretty eager to throw in with somebody you barely know. Were you stalking me? I don't appreciate being stalked. Get lost. Eh, you know what? Yes, I absolutely am. Just give me a shot. That's all I'm asking. I could be the best damn crew you ever hired. I've heard enough. You're hired. All right, Felix. Tell me why I should hire you. Okay, Felix, consider this your interview. Temperament. If you're trying to convince me to hire you, you're going about it all wrong. I'm not going to repeat myself. Get lost. Huh. Sure, an interview. 
That sounds fair. I mean, first time for everything, right? Ask me anything you like. <laughs> Intelligence plus the value of pi. Um, 3.14. You want to tell me why you're out of work. Are you kidding? I love a good fight. One time, I took an autoloader's head clean off its servos with one swing of a tossball stick. You can count on me in a scrap, boss. That's a promise. Perfect, you're hired. What's the value of pie? What's your biggest flaw? You, why you're out? Sorry, Felix. You know what? Wow. You don't know how long I've been waiting to hear that. Thanks, boss. You're not going to regret this. You got a crew now, Felix. Hold on. We can actually go in. Wait a minute, that's not. That wasn't. I thought that was money that we could actually go and get the. Okay, we need to. <laughs> um Okay, that was a bad idea. Um
either of the assault cruisers ever put into groundbreaking? CCN 76 milk chocolate bar with caramel and pea free nuts in it. It's time for a KYL. Okay. Ah, the old rest and go. With all the luxury and comfort of a shipping container. Um... Great law, is it hot in here? Or is it just my glands acting up again? Bet your glands acting up again. Depends. What are you planning to do with it? Forge papers to go to this antique, obviously. <laughs> See the lights. Taking a show or two at the infamous Bijou. Could be a treat if you like that kind of thing. All right, I'll sell it to you. But it's going to cost you dear. Anything else, dear? Uh, so what about that offer from me? F mm, I wanted to talk about that opportunity you mentioned. Yes, dearie. What did you take that darling ship of yours down to Roseway, where that distress signal I told you about came from? Okay, and Roseway. Found out some tasty corporate secrets for old Gladys. Shouldn't be too tough for a fellow like you, I think. Any time, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Here, take a candy with you. <clears throat> okay, people, back to the ship. We need to go to Roseway.
and I don't know where Roseway is. Hmm, okay. Well, I am going to leave it here for now. Um... We did manage to get a crew, but um, I am not sure where uh, Okay, I need to go to Cecilia, or Roseway, sorry. I, um, yeah, well, we'll get over there, um, But yeah, we'll... Wow. Okay, cool. Um... I don't know where this place is at. Uh, Roseway. Um... So I'm gonna leave it here. I know I've already said that 400 times. But, uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. You take care of yourselves. I'll catch you later. I'm out. Peace.